Yeah, Deshaun is a 20 year old college student working at Chick-fil-A. After wrecking his car, he got permission to park it here. But one day during his shift, his car was being carried away on a tow truck he never called. It was just bad luck after bad luck. It was like I wrecked it and it got stolen. A repo gone wrong. Last month, the 20 year old Deshaun Nance got into a wreck. Needing to save money up for a tow, the college student asked his work if he could leave his red Mustang convertible behind Chick fil A on Garth Brooks Boulevard until he could find the cash. We actually park over there in the Target parking lot. That's kind of shared between Target and Chick fil A, and we got the okay from them. But two days later, his car was loaded up onto a tow truck that he never called. One of my coworkers came to me and was like this, like, Deshaun, Deshaun. I was like, they're towing your car outside. I was like, they're towing it. And I was like, I was like, I didn't call a tow truck company or anything. By the time I got outside and stuff, they were already like down there at the light and they were already like gone. Now Yukon police are asking for your help identifying the thief hidden in plain sight. It happened in broad daylight. So a lot of people would just think that that's just a normal type of activity. We are under the impression right now that it's definitely not somebody local and it's not a reputable tow company that we deal with. Authorities say all repo companies must call police on their way to a pickup and most should have markings on their trucks. As authorities follow up on leads, Deshaun is hoping for a change in luck. I was actually getting ready to sell that car to make some more money because I'm actually a college student right now and I was like I was paying for college and all this stuff and I still need to pay off the school bill too. Now, police have received numerous tips from the community and are following up on several leads. Now, if you have any information, you are asked to call the Yukon Police Department.